This trade method is going to be good for the entire season. And this is my gold common method, also known as the John Sims gold common method. But it's an infinite coin glitch. And if you're beginners, I've made, helped people go from never playing the game to over 20 million. So if you want to be a part of that, just make sure you guys tune into our daily content where we post a daily podcast or come to a live stream where I can help you out myself, where I trade for you, not for me. So the first thing you guys want to do is you want to test the market. But this is the filter that I use today for this exact trade. So the idea behind this is you can switch these out at any point, but the main concept is you're going to be popping these in and out, in and out. Some of these will fill up. They'll be really good for a brief period, and then they'll just absolutely get destroyed. What matters is the margin on the trade. So the first thing I always do after I test a filter is I go to that max buy now, and then I'm wanting to see what these are selling for, okay? So it looks like they're actually selling about 800 coins right now. Those are getting eaten alive on the transfer market there. 800. They're selling it looks like I'm going to go ahead and buy these around 550 So we just rocked out with about 12 different trades here as you can see These are some trades from a different filter that we're using in prem center backs uh, We just went through and won about 12 of these as you can see some of these I'm winning at 450 550 some of them at 500 550 anything like that so What I want to show you guys is we have a 12,000 point FIFA point contest going on so follow us on Twitter How is that a lot of coins? It's only 400 coins coins every 60 minutes takes me about two and a half minutes to bid on a card. So that means I can bid on 50 cards 24 times. Now, all I need to do is win about 10 to 15 of those to hit these numbers. Now, I like to be about 15. If I'm near 15, I will stick on the filter because sometimes it'll go from 12. Sometimes I'll win 18. Sometimes I'll win 15. This is what you call marginal trading. This is what we call being a market maker. But essentially what happens is we multiply this by 15. That means that we can win up to 360 cards. Now, sometimes we're going to relist. So I'm going to pull the number down just a little bit, 300 coins, okay? If we hit that, and if I sell these at 800 coins, and I'm buying in between 450 to 550, let's just say 500, that means I have a 260 coin profit margin. That means that if I sell 300 of those within an hour, boom, I'm making about 80,000 coins an hour. How can I make this 100? Maybe I list them up for 850. However, maybe they don't sell at that point, so you have to be careful. And that's what the trick about this is. And so when you go in and you start selling this stuff, you want to come in and you want to check the market before you do anything. And as you guys know, we showed you the, where the sell point was. We showed you where the buy point is. And boom, that's how you take the margin. Before you go and you just start using this filter, you want to make sure that you can get those sales so come by the live stream ask me questions and i'll help you guys with that sell point until next time guys that is the gold common method that is the john sims method you want to know more make sure you guys reach out we'll see you guys soon